It's a scandal. An absolute outrage. Locked. Holmes, how is... This bin is full of empty bottles. I had thought that all Station Masters knew the Morse code, but apparently not. A telegraph. How could he fall asleep at work like this? Excuse me, sir. Wake up. Ah, his breath. He must have swallowed half a distillery. And that explains the how. By his sleeping off the alcohol, you mean? Wake up, please, sir. Huh. What? The 18 hours 72 train has arrived? Good day to you. We are investigating the disappearance of last night's train, and we should like to ask you a few questions. Were there any passengers who got off that particular train at your station last night? No. Nobody, it seems to me. Although I did not leave my office, so... No doubt you were very busy. You don't say. You can't ever get any peace around here. Now nah, you have to send a telegram each time a train arrives and departs. Oop. Station Master Bertram from Bridlington showed me a strange telegram that he received from you last night. It concerned the train, but it was barely comprehensible. What? He's a fastidious little twerp, that Bertram. I remember everything quite clearly. It was late, and I was tired, but I did my work. So what? There's no need to be so petty. You were not tired, you were inebriated. Tell me the truth now, or I shall not hesitate to document your state in my report. My friend means that you will end up by being sacked from your position. All right. So I was drunk. I don't remember all of yesterday, to be truthful to you. Please don't go harsh on me. Holmes, this man has consumed a considerable amount of alcohol. He's not entirely helpless yet, but... It will not be long before he is. Obviously, his testimony cannot be trusted. Get any peace.
This bin is full of empty bottles. A fishing advertisement. A handcar wheelbase. Interesting. It appears that elements of the same construction were scattered everywhere. Watson, please tell me, do you believe in magic? Of course not, Holmes. Then you are of the opinion that a train cannot simply disappear? Well, we both know that that is obvious. Why are you asking such peculiar questions? A little patience, Watson. You will understand my point quite soon. So, are you quite certain that you saw the train at Evesham Station? Well, yes, of course. We saw it coming. The headlights and heard the whistle. But that is it. We didn't see the train itself. Oh, uh, but... Oh, Holmes, I'm a little confused. The whole train just disappeared. It's unbelievable. I should use the appropriate object here. 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 I should use the appropriate object. I should. I should use. So, now here we have the fake train that we saw approaching Evesham Station last night. Doesn't look much like a train to me. Be patient, Watson. I haven't finished yet. Try using your imagination. Our train requires only a headlight and a steam whistle. We need to attach a head... I need something I need something long for the headlight to be a The long pole is now attached. It will allow us to connect the headlight. 
The headlight is attached. The steam whistle is now connected. Holmes, what can we do to make the steam whistle work? It is elementary, my dear Watson. We shall need a fire extinguisher. The fire extinguisher. Now let us see what we have here. The steam whistle is ready to be used. Watson, I do believe that we have created an exact replica of the train that vanished in front of us last night. The criminal mind can be most inventive. I am somewhat in awe. So, such a thing is possible. If someone went to all the trouble of creating this fake train, then it was surely with the intention of stealing the real one. Ah, Watson, you should not jump to conclusions. In fact, this does not tell us very much at all except that the train did not evaporate into thin air. Although you half suspected it. Huh. At any rate, we now need to find where the real train might be hidden. I suggest we use my archives to find a more detailed map of our surroundings. Well, I hope that justifies our having to load your massive archive suitcase onto the cab. It made us extremely unpopular with our driver. Now we have two maps. We must combine them properly. Here it is. There is a side branch to the railway. Its first switch is located between Bridlington and Chesterfield stations. There is one more station to be visited. It is located between Chesterfield and Evesham, and there should be a side railway to the nearby quarry. There is a small section of a railway at the end of Evesham station. Rusted, but it still works. Mines. This is interesting. It would be quite possible for someone to redirect the train towards the mines. <laughs> 